Hey guys, you're watching Zuban and I'm AJ, and we are back on another episode of Let's Build a City. What episode are we on? Let's get it right, I haven't done it for a while. We are on episode 148. Can you believe it? Now, I've been a little bit lazy at the beginning of this year. There's a lot of stuff that needs to be done off camera. For example, like here, this all needs to be uh, like concreted up. There's too much greenery. Fitting some trees in some places, just filling the map out generally with little bits like that. But I've been a little bit lazy. So, uh, whip me into action, guys. Tell me in the comment section, AJ, do some off-camera work. Fill up the world. <laughs> Give me some encouragement. So, today, we've got this little space here. We're right on the beachfront. Originally, I was going to do this over by our mansions. We've got those two huge mansions at the back of the world. And this building is going to be in a similar style to them, but it's not going to be that big but it's going to be sort of modern but colorful it's uh, it's going to be an interesting mix i think so i thought this spot here was going to be the perfect spot for it it's going to be a little bit of sort of building management to fit it into this gap here but i think we can do it let me move my mic does that sound better that should that should be better so if there's a little bit of noise there what block should we use i'm thinking some quartz some nice white pillared quartz it's a lovely wall block what color though orange Orange. Have we got much orange stuff? We've got that birch there. That might be a little bit too much orange in the area. What about... We want the clay. What about... Oh, that... Ah, oh, no. I've got blue near us. Pink. We've got that purple there. So maybe that pink will work out really, really well. Okay. And then we're going to need some sort of other block. I think this stone will look nice. And I think that'll do for now. That'll do for the blocks for now. So what we're going to do is we're going to come over here. We're going to start as close to this building as we so dare. And we're going to place down... Uh, is that is that about the right distance? Yeah, that'll be nice, won't it? How close are we to the road? We've got a little bit of room. We want enough room for a bit of a driveway, maybe. So let's move it back a couple of blocks, maybe. Something like that. What we're going to do is we're going to come across maybe like three blocks. And then we can have a window in there. And then we want a nice space for doors. So we can put the doors in there. Yep, I like that. And then what we're going to do is we're going to come out with some, either the stone or this pink stained clay. I'm thinking pink stained clay. So let's come out here. We're going to have another window in there. And then we're going to come around to here and put down a nice pillar of stone. That's just going to break up the colours a little bit more, make it look a little bit more interesting. And then we're going to come down here with another couple of small one wide two or three tall uh, windows and there's a matter of mirroring it again on this side so it's going to be pretty much symmetrical on both sides of this house they are very appealing when they're symmetrical how did I do this I done two blocks and then two blocks for some sort of door well we don't need a door on this so we only need a door on well no let's do it why not uh, like this and like this we can always take the door out at a later point if we don't really like it so that's the front and then down the side, ow, I just hit my knee. That really, really hurt. Don't laugh. Don't laugh. So <laughs> let's come down this side here. And then we want a couple of windows in this side. Let's come across. We'll have one window there. And should we do two wide windows? We could do it like that, couldn't we? That gives it a nice depth to the house. Mm -hmm. And then we'll do the same on this side. So we've done three blocks. And then two wide window two blocks and then another two wide window and then let's mirror it the same as the other side there so we do three blocks on this side as well like this and now the back the back I would really like a chimney on the back here somewhere but mixing it in still with the pink so if we have hmm another door on the back here would that be too many doors do I like that window? See, this is this is a weird thing to be uh, to, to see sometimes, right? On the front here, a window would go lovely in here because we've got one block on either side. But on the inside, the window goes up to the wall, which I don't like. And I know a lot of people don't like. But as soon as we work mostly on the outside of buildings, I'm not really too bothered about it. I think we can get away with it. So we're going to have another door in the back here somewhere. In fact... Yeah, let's do it like that. So it's going to be one door in the middle and then glass blocks up either side. I think that'd be a good idea, wouldn't it? And then we'll come out another block like this. Start with some pink. Again, we want it like on a C shape. We're just trying to place down where we want windows at first, really. And then we're going to come along here. We'll have another window like that. 
Where's the middle? Let's do the same on this side and then we can work out the fireplace to fit in between those two. So, we have that there. Then we had the three blocks. Well, I don't want a door on this side. We've definitely got too many doors at the minute. So instead, we can have a couple of... Well, let's do windows down to the floor. Hmm, that could be nice. I love making stuff up as we go along. It's just the best. It really, really is. Uh, is that in line? Yeah, one block shorter. One block shorter, beautiful. And then this comes down here. Like this. Like that. And that gives us a little bit of a space for a little fireplace to go up the whole back of the building. I think the easiest way to do this house is going to actually be start with the back wall, unlike what we usually do, where we usually start with the facade or the front of the building. So up this back here, how tall do we want these windows? We've got two blocks tall, which would be that tall, or we can have them three blocks tall. How beautiful is this pink stained clay? Three blocks tall, which will give us that height. Hmm. You know, I like the three high ones. It's modern. Modern houses always have, like, really tall, really nice, very square windows, aren't they? Modern houses in general are usually quite blocky, aren't they? They are very Minecrafty in a way. So we'll have that going up there. And then again, we want... Where's the ceiling going to be? If we Let's get a slab. If we had the ceiling to the ground floor here at this height, that means that we'd need a block on top, and then the windows would start again on this height. Yeah? That looks pretty good. That looks pretty nice, doesn't it? Let's take those slabs away. I don't want them there for the minute. So then here we'll have another three high window. Beautiful. Oh, that's already looking really nice. I can see some potential. Okay, so we'll go there. I also, I might do the interior to this house. Hey? Does it sound like a plan? Sound like a plan? Oh, I tell you what, saying about interiors, I haven't got round, I'm sorry guys, I haven't got round to doing the interior to that mansion that we built quite a while ago. We've done a couple of episodes on it, um, but yeah, I still haven't got round to doing that. I forgot about it, in fact, completely forgot about it. Okay, and then on the back here, we shouldn't really be worrying about um, roofs just yet, but what I think we're going to do, we're going to do a very modern short roof on it, so something like this. And something like that on the top of that chimney breast. No. No, let's bring the the chimney breast through the top here. Not very high. Not too much higher than the house. But something, something like that. That's looking really, really cool, isn't it? I like that. Okay, and on the back here, let's get a block of normal quartz here just to go in the bottom here. Seeing as though glass panes are going to go straight on top of that. We want these windows again. Well, these windows, in fact, have to be four blocks high, don't they? They have to be, um, whoops, like this. Boop, boop. Ah. <coughs> and then very carefully place the quartz on top. There, there, there. Hmm. See, see on the top of these glass panes here? Can you see that little, like, funny glitch? That sort of happens when I move. I'm pretty sure you can see that on YouTube. I noticed this with the fences. Was it last episode? Like, you get these two bits in the middle here. And then when you put another fence, it sort of changes. Do you see that? It's so strange. So we've got two lines down it. And then we've got one line. And then we've got no lines. Very strange. I don't know what's going on. I swear that wasn't in the last update. And I just noticed on the top of the panes there. Not that it's that big of a deal. But I tell you, it's going to get on my nerves. <laughs> that sort of stuff always does get on my nerves. Silly little things like that. Okay, so then we're going to extend these up. These windows on the side here. These are only going to be three blocks tall. So we'll just place some wood, some um, clay down. So we can place the quartz on top. The same on this side. That way, they, the quartz face the right way. Because if we don't do it, look, they face that way. We don't want them facing that way. We want them facing straight up. I love this. The quartz pillar block is such a beautiful block. Really, really is. Okay, so we're going to have a door in there. We'll have some glass panes on top. And then that will go Oops, nicely on top like that. Same thing goes here. Wonderful. Wonderful. That's looking pretty nice. Now, this roof here, I'm not sure on how we want to do. I don't know if I want it to go up this way and connect up to the pink like at a 
at an angle like that. I don't know if I want it to go back. I don't know if I want it to go forward. I don't want if I don't know if I want it to be a normal peak on it. We could do a, a really low peak maybe. Or we could have it going towards the back every three blocks. Like this. But the trouble with this, let's get a splash potion. The trouble with this is it's gonna give us a huge, big, boring face on the front here. I suppose we could put in some windows, some like modern windows that go like along like that. Yeah. That looks okay. That adds some more light in, doesn't it? Yeah, we'll go with that. So it's going to be the same on the other side. Let me do this exact wall there, and I'll be right back, okay? Okay, that's looking good. We're getting some real progress done, hey? So quick. Now, for the front here, we need to be careful how high we bring these pillars, right? Because I like doing really interesting looking uh, sort of rooms, if you like. Do I like that? Yeah, it's a good height. That's a good height. Um, sort of interesting looking from the outside. Which means we put roofs in places where people might not think about putting roofs. Uh, you know, instead of it being just a normal two high, two story, boringly shaped square house. We like adding like really, really weird ones. So what we're going to do is we're going to go there. And then we're going to think about a roof to go straight on top. So if we had something like that, that would be... Hmm, what blocks? If we use this block, right? And then we come out one block wider. Again, I like using slabs instead of stairs on these modern houses. Because they're a little bit gentler. The roofs are a little bit less sloped, a little bit less urgent. So they do look... On some houses, they look better. Not on all houses. You know, a lot of houses it looks best to, or best with just stairs. But sometimes, sometimes it looks nice with, with slabs instead. So that's going to come up there. Which then means our second story, I'm not going to do it in line with this one. I'm actually going to do this second story one block out. Something like that. Okay. And then this one is going to come up. We can either put uh, one big window in or a couple of small windows in. If we done one big window, it could be the master bedroom, couldn't it? So if we done it along like this. And then the master bedroom is right at the front of the house with a really snazzy big window there. That looks pretty cool. Let's go with that. And then this quartz. Um, hmm. I tell you what. Let's come back a couple of blocks with this pink. Okay. Because I don't want the quartz to line up. Like I was going to put the quartz straight on top of that. But that would mean it would be very, very bland on the front, wouldn't it? It would like be a huge bland bit. In fact, let's go another block back. Okay. It's still a nice size, a nice width for the master bedroom. And then on the side here, what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to come out. How many blocks do we come out? Let's just do that for now. Like that. And then what we want is we want blocks going along here. Because the window isn't going to fit in. Because we're going to need slabs along here to there. And then, whoops. The slabs are going to come up on the edge here. So much to think about with, with these roofs. There's so much you need to try and fit into your head. So then we need another layer of quartz to go on top and then the window ones can go on top of that so we can do two windows like that that fits in really really well doesn't it so then that'll go up like so well we do shorter windows couldn't we some some short windows just two high ones like we had that there and that there that looks pretty good that does look pretty nice so put those under there look how much progress we've done we've been going like 15 minutes and we've got a really good start to a house going okay so let's do the same thing on this one we'll come back and out here drag it along now how did I do this nice and easy nice and easy we can do that so we're gonna come along here another block on top and then it was two blocks high for the window we've gone one too many blocks out haven't we yeah remove those ones and then quartz along the top. I think that was right, wasn't it? That should match up. Yeah, it does. Wonderful. Splash me. Okay, so the side on this second story. Or do we go to the back on this second story? Hmm. Well, it's quite odd because the first story, or, 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 or this on the front, the second story is actually a lot higher than the second story on the back. So 
How do we get round that? Do we? We've got two choices. We either have like a stairway in the middle of it rising up, or we just rise up this floor. Oops. Whoa, 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 whoa. What am I breaking? Or we raise this story windows to be up, yeah, same height as that one. I reckon we do that. So that was to there. And the same here. So we're going to add another two blocks, basically, to the height, to the ceiling of the ground floor. Going to be a very tall interior. Very beautifully tall interior. So that goes along there. That goes along there. Oh, uh, up another one. Ah, 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 ah. Like that. And then on top of this, we then do our... Whoa, 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 whoa. Why does it do that sometimes? That's so frustrating. Okay, so that goes something like that. Uh, no, and then that, that can stay up that height still. Maybe even add another one to it. Wonderful. Aha. Uh -huh. So now they're... Although these windows look like they're at separate heights, it's just that these windows are taller because you're going to actually stand on this level here. Okay? This is the level you're going to stand on. So, yeah. That works out good. That'll be good. That'll work out fine. So, on the back here, we just want to come back a few blocks. Something, maybe that's one too many. Maybe two blocks. If we come back on this pink. And the same over here. This is where it gets tricky. This is where any house building on Minecraft gets tricky. Is tying them in together. Uh, especially here. This roof is going to be a very tricky bit. Um, if we now come... Out below here. Uh, eh, 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 eh. Nope, not there. So that's four blocks. And that lines up pretty well. Window. We put a window in there. That works out nice. Uh huh. And then below here, we just need to join these up together. Like so. Pop. Uh huh. That side. Then that side. Uh huh. Do we want any windows on the side here? I think we've had. I think we've got enough windows at the minute. So let's just build this up. We'll get the window a nice height. Like one more. There we go. Wonderful. And then this roof on the back, I'm going to slant up very slightly. I think something like that. Okay. Now the same has to be done on the other side. Let me do that, and I'll be right back. We're just cutting out some unneeded time here. Okay then, so that's now mirrored on both sides. Is that the right height? Is it the right height? Looks like there's another block on there. It could be the angle that I'm sitting on my TV at. Yeah, I think it is. It is in line. Fine. Okay, so roof now. Roof material. I'm thinking brick. Because we haven't really done... I know it sounds really, really weird <laughs> to have a brick roof. But I mainly go with colours when it comes to Minecraft. Whatever colours work are the ones that I'll go with. So I think a nice red roof will go really well with the pink. And along this one. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, that'll look nice. With the quartz on either side here. And then that's fine around that side. That's fine around that side. This part needs to be filled in. Like that, so you can't see it from the outside now. Same with this side. Oh, we just need to add one over here. Like that. Obviously the glass needs to go in. But that's easy enough to do. The big problem here is lining up this roof now. So what we want to do is we've done that too high, didn't we? So it's going to drop down by half a block at the front. And then let's do this along here. This is tricky. Um, as, as you guys know, I make up these buildings as I go along. But it's definitely not an easy one to try and work out. That's for sure. So something like this. I'm trying to get a real gradual increase. Oops. Like that. That works out pretty well. Yeah, I like that. I like that. And then again, we're going to have to go with these bricks along here. And then we're going to have to add a little bit of pink at the back here. Because as you can see, we can sort of see through it. Uh, we don't need to go that back that far though with these ones, do we? Like this. Like this. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah. We're running out of room. <laughs> eh. There we go. Wonderful. And then we're at the top here. 
So these can go straight across like this, straight across there, and straight across there. That's a really nice roof. In fact, I would really like this, though, to be up half a slab. If we done it on this level, oops, not on there, on this level instead, that would look better, I think. Let's take that one away. Wonderful. Yeah, that looks better. Very, very modern. Splash me. Perfect. Looks beautiful. Really, really nice roof. I love doing as complicated roofs as I can possibly do. Um, they just make a building look so much better. They really, really do. So let's go there. Wonderful. So now that's all hidden from that side. It's going to be the same on this side. We can probably do it really, really quickly. Should we do it quickly? No, no, no. Let's move on to another bit of the roof. So next roof is this top one. I'll do that bit off camera in a minute. So we're going to come around here and then up this bit. Take that one away like that. Take those three away. Um, hmm. Like, let's redo it. Do it like this. Put that pink one back there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I like that. That's a nice, that's a nice angle. Okay, so then on this side, we've just got to match it up again. Like so. And it's going to come along here. And on this one, it's just going to be a really nice low roof. So we're going to come up here. Oops. And then up this one. Like that. Around the top. Let's not go too far. Make sure we can match it up correctly. If you go all the way around, you'll forget what you've done on the way back when you come back. So it's very important to take your time with them and just do it piece by piece. So we're going to come up like this, like this, and around there. Okay, now this pink bit. How are we going to do this? Hmm. You know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking. Of course you don't know what I'm thinking. I'm thinking it. Why did I even ask that? <laughs> Let's put a, 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 a line of pink. A a a I'm stuttering because I'm excited. I, I don't stutter. I don't have a speech impediment. I'll have that along there. Have this one along there. And then this roof will be nice and flat, I think. Or maybe, maybe a very slight increase. Very slight. Like that. Mmm. No, we need to go up another half a block if we're going to do that. Yeah, we can do that. Come up half a block there. Oops. Half a block there. And then the roof will go on really, really easily then. So we just place along there. Half a block up. Oops. And then this is as high as it goes. So we can go along here. Ha 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 ha. How are we doing for time? Let me check how we're doing for time. Okay, we are running out of time for this episode. But we are going to do another episode here because we're going to have to finish this house off and do the rest of the outside, the driveway and stuff like that. That's one of my favourite parts to do. That really, really is. Uh, in fact, you know what? I think I'm going to leave it there. We've only got a little bit more to do. We've only got that roof to do, that roof to do. And then the outside, it's a matter of putting the glass in, some window sills and stuff like that. But that's a really nice shaped house, don't you guys think? That's a beautifully shaped house. A really nice size to fit into that spot perfectly as well. I can't wait to get that finished. Alright guys, if you enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you haven't already, please subscribe and we shall see you in the next episode. Bye!